WCBI First Alert AccuWeather Forecast with meteorologist Jacob Dickey. Nice and quiet out there, just the way we all like it. No rain, no storms, just a clear sky, comfortable temperatures too, really maybe even a little cool out there, down to 54 in Louisville. Now tonight's forecast is going to be all about the dew point. That's going to be a key here moving forward. We'll talk about that quite a bit. 53 is where the dew point is in Louisville. As we see our temperatures, they fell quickly. The reason is when we have dry air in place, when our dew point values are so low, we can efficiently cool off the atmosphere very quickly. And so once that sunset, our temperatures quickly tumbled already down to 59 in Columbus, 57 in Starkville, 58 in Winona, still at 60 in Tupelo, and 61 in West Point. We also can use the dew point to tell where the floor is, where the bottom is as far as our low temperatures go. For the most part, they're down in the mid to low 50s out there. With light north winds, I still think a little drier air will continue to work on in. That means that tonight our temperatures will fall down into the low 50s, maybe even a spot or two under a mostly clear sky tonight into the upper 40s. We should be in those low 60s this time of year, all the way down to 51 in Columbus, Starkville, and West Point. 50 in Pontotoc and Tupelo, 49 in Iuka overnight tonight. As we look at future cast staying dry here, it does suggest maybe a few clouds and an isolated sprinkle just off to our north and our west. I really think in our area, though, we'll be keeping things dry. We'll call it mostly clear to partly cloudy as we start the day on Tuesday. Temperatures then with dry air, not only do they cool off quickly, but it warms up fairly quickly, too. By the lunchtime, we're into the 70s. I think we're heading for the mid to upper 70s out there with a mix of sun and clouds, keeping things dry and light north winds generally between 2 and 7 miles an hour. 75 will be the high in Tupelo, 74 in Amory and in Aberdeen, Calhoun City and Bruce also up to 75. More mid to upper 70s into the Golden Triangle, 78 in Columbus, 77 in Macon, Starkville at 76. We'll get to 79 in Kosciuszko. Ackerman all the way up to 77. West Alabama enjoying the nice weather also. 74 in Soligent, 75 in Vernon and Reform. Aliceville up to 76 tomorrow. Now as we look ahead here, temperatures will slowly climb here as we go through the middle to latter parts of the week up into the upper 80s out there. But again, the dew point will be a factor here. We've got some dry air in here, so this is comfortable. We've got the 70s and low 80s. As we get south wind back, then it brings some Gulf moisture back. When we see our dew points get into the upper 60s, close to 70, that's when things can feel a little bit uncomfortable. I think we'll see our first 90 later on this week as well. And that south wind comes into play when this high pressure slides off to our east there. Maybe an isolated shower on Wednesday into Thursday. Very light, though. Not expecting a whole lot there. I think many of us staying partly cloudy as we go for the next couple of days here. If you get a shower, consider yourself lucky. Overnight tonight, cooling off into the low 50s, maybe upper 40s out there under a mostly clear sky. The week ahead looking pretty quiet overall. We've got some 70s and 80s on the board as we climb into the weekend. A couple scattered showers and storms possible Sunday and Monday.